Oh, about a quarter mile behind him, probably. Did you see anything? I saw the whole thing. What happened? Well, I don't know what late, because there was a shit, there was probably a hundred cars here. They all left afterwards, but from the tire tracks, I think he was in that lane, and he started coming over. Car? I, I think, I saw a car, I think a car swerved in front of him, mm -hmm. and then he, you know, he couldn't do anything, and he swerved this way a little bit to try to avoid it, and then lost control, and he, I mean, he went directly into that median. The truck was almost completely turned around, slammed into the median. Boom. Guys, I, the guy got pulled out of the truck by two other semi drivers. I tried to get up there, but they were already up there, and that thing was, and that thing was on fire, man. Hey, I've seen the worst wreck I've ever seen was on this same hill at night. Oh, really? And people just plowed into all the cops and everything that was responding to the crash. There were cars off here, cop cars smashed in the middle, just mayhem, you know. I tell you what, man, that, there was. I stopped up past that, probably 100 feet past that 40 sign there. That's where I ended up, and there was this whole thing was packed with cars, and the only two that stayed was me and that semi driver that helped them out. So I wouldn't, I wasn't about to go buy that thing, man. That thing was making noises I'd never heard before. Yeah, it looks like that fire's burned itself out now.